Um, I guess just we we felt like we've been there before. You know what I mean? Um, obviously, it's a exciting environment playing in here, crowd going crazy and all that. But uh, we didn't play a ton of games like that, right? I mean, this year, last year. So I think that trust is just what helped us. 65 and 17. What does it mean for you to be a part of this? I mean, it's great. It's all going well. Um, obviously, I'd like to get a championship <laughs> to go along with that, but that doesn't diminish anything that we've done. You know, seasons are hard. It's a long season, ups and downs of a season. So, uh, you know, it's, it's dope to be a part of that with this franchise and have an opportunity to have the most wins this franchise ever had. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, guys are pros. Guys are pros. Guys have their routines. Some guys train after the game, before the game, whatnot. It's just, uh, I mean, it's not like we're the only team in the league that does that. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just. Some things always sort of go on and take place. You just get a chance to see it. Oh, man, it leads to everything that we do. You know what I mean? It's that confidence of uh, knowing when we come to the huddle. Everybody know they got a job to do. Everybody get their input. Uh, we don't really get rattled like that. Um, you know, we, we, we lose at times. <laughs> you know, and we, we understand. We try to learn from it. But we also try to learn from our wins. You know, and uh, we say it all the time, man. It's just a fun team to be around. I do what now? Yeah. Um. Listen, man, when you're out here playing basketball, especially against elite teams like that, you ain't playing checkers. You're playing chess. You know what I mean? So it's, it's a thinking game. You can't just be running around out there like this ain't no pickup game. Come up here, one. Bring a chair. So, so we just, uh, it's just all strategy. That's all it is. It means a whole lot, um, you know, being here seven years now and, you know, just learning more and more about, you know, the franchise and the organization, the people that have came before us and, you know, now to be up there with them ones, you know, it, it, it feels good. I mean, a lot, you know, we, we learn through experience. Um, you know, it's those type of games where I think there's a lot of missed layups, a lot of fouls today, a lot of missed open shots, and still find a way to come out with the win on the road is, is always important. I mean, we know what we're working for. You know, strength and condition is a big part of what we do out there. And, you know, through my years at NBA and, and learning and, you know, having good vets around, you know, you, you realize how important the weight, weight room is. So, you know, it's our job as leaders to make sure everybody is, you know, not only getting the work in on the court, but, you know, making sure their body is activated and, and ready to go. just been there before um, we know the antics we we understand that we do have a target on our backs being the best team in the NBA um, so all that comes with it um, but we just you know we all we always preach the wear down effect and just weather the storm there's going to be runs and you know that's when we need each other more that's when we come together It's the best thing ever. 
Tell you the truth, um, for me, knowing him since before his rookie year, playing against him for years, and now getting a chance for him to be my teammate and to know that he's a killer and he didn't, did everything you could possibly do to get on this stage. You know what I mean? And now uh, I think everybody else in the world getting to see what we knew already, but you just, sometimes you just need a few, few other pieces or whatnot to get that opportunity. And uh, I remember that. I remember like my first couple years in the league and not being in the playoffs or whatnot and just thriving. And I'm glad that I just get to be a part of it with him. Everything. Um, it, it's changed the trajectory of, of my career. Um, always being a, a fan first, you know, and then getting the, the behind the scenes, you know. Everybody gets to see what, what he's been doing on the court for the past 20 years. Um, but nobody gets to see the behind the scenes of it. And, you know, I'm, I'm privileged, you know, to, to be able to see it every day and just be a sponge to it. You know, learn, pick up things. You no, know, even not even through conversation, just watching, um, and it's been it's been the biggest help, not just for me, but for everybody on this team. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's bigger than it's bigger in basketball with us. We know we got lifetime long friendships and relationships. Um, and that's important. You know, I think Chris can tell you better than me, but you don't find that in this league very often. So, you know, I think that is a direct translation to our to our performance on the court. It's grown, man. I'm telling you. You play in this league for a long time, some people just your teammates. You know what I mean? You're like, oh yeah, I played with that dude. You know, but I regardless what happens, um, you would have seen the way we were with Javon Carter. You would have seen the way we were when T. Craig got traded back to us. You know what I mean? We always on FaceTime right away. <coughs> Only person on our team I probably won't really fool with when we get done is uh Mikhail Bridges. He's a bad guy. <laughs> yeah. He <laughs> He is a horrible human being. <laughs> hey, check his close friends. <laughs> I swear, appreciate y'all. Appreciate it. Hey, kill.